Those were among the incidents after the arrest of the activist Mr. Morarake Baso in Nairobi while he, he just exited the Radio Maisha radio station. So he was taken to current police station to record a statement over the charges that he mentioned that are that caused the disruption. He said that Kufa Derefa, Kufa Makanga remarks. So that remark has been is not being taken lightly in the recent days taking the political temperature in Kenya is growing and rising. So he was taken to the current police station and the current situation is he has been released. But here are some of the tweets which were trending at the moment. It's very clear that most tweets are suggesting that he was the one who was armed and not is not the one who is supposed to record the statement according to the social media post. So it has been almost four days he was in a, in a hospital in the city and he is now well. Yesterday he attended a meeting at Spice FM and today he also attended an interview with Radio Maisha but immediately after he stepped out of Radio Maisha he was arrested and taken to Langata police station. So. They just they they bundled him into a car and dragged him to Langata police station. So that was the moment with that thing happened. But since then nothing has been established much, but the charges were related to the Kufa Makanga Kufa Dereva incident. So that's what is happening. The media has been doing random interviews mm. where they give the microphone to random people and the random people say what they feel. And if you've been keenly watching through those interviews, as I have been watching, then you realize that the message has been impeach both of them. But they don't downplay the, your method of data collection. Observation is a primary source of data collection. So it yes. begins there. Yes, in fact, there are observational studies there, there and there are scientific studies for that matter. Yes. As, as for what you refer to as random, that is also a perfect way of gathering information, me, which means someone can say, you didn't select, you didn't predetermine, you randomly selected. Now, if you randomly select, and that is the response that you say you have garnered, there is credence to it. It is not something that you can ignore. Yes. Yes. Um, but I think the members of parliament had a different opinion. The members of parliament had a predetermined opinion when they were going for public participation. And I believe our members of parliament have lost uh, the true understanding of what public participation is. Uh, the members of parliament in Kenya wameacha kuwa wajumbe. Mm. Because mjumbe comes from the word ujumbe. Mm. And the work of mjumbe ni kutoa ujumbe ambayo imetoka kwa wananchi kupeleka kwa bunge. Bunge ya ujumbe mm. ambayo imeletwa na wajumbe but now our members of parliament are bringing ujumbe to the people mm. <laughs> all right they've reversed they've the reversed role. the role they are the ones informing the public rather than the public informing them mm. they forgot that they were elected to represent the public and that the public is the one that they are representing in parliament. You do know that when you represent the public, there's the element of accountability that comes along with it. And if you look at those whom we refer to as elected leaders, they are loath to any form of accountability, completely loath to it. They, they abrogated that particular function a long time. It's most likely that these are the most words which must have led to him to be arrested because he also insisted still on the same issue of that they should be impeached port. So that issue of same Kufa Makanga Kufa Dereva, that might be the main reason why Morara Kibaso was arrested.
Remember the other day, the moment he said that he will be in Bomas, he went to Bomas and you saw what happened. So it seems that the NIS have been following this guy wherever he goes to media, radio station and others. So they followed what he said yesterday on the to the masses and today they saw that after that moment he will just get out they must arrest him because he, he has been talking about this issue of impeachment and remember this is the critical day of the impeachment motion so they might have thought that he may come out and influence masses to occupy the parliament because right now at nairobi the parliament is beefed up with so much security that you can't imagine